Hello and welcome to Zoho CRM. My name is Jason from the Blue Root team and in this video I'm going to show you just how simple it can be to set up a meeting within CRM. Now the way that I'm about to show you can be done from a few places but I ultimately want to show you the simplest way which can be done from any window in the system. But before I do that I want to also add that if you ever open a specific contact, like perhaps a gym, you can always repeat the steps with more or less the same instructions by simply creating a new open activity and selecting event, which will soon be called meeting. Now, the reason that I'm showing you this other way is because you can literally do it from anywhere in the system because it's connected to this top banner here. And before I show you the steps, the last thing that I want to add is that the events module in CRM will soon be renamed to meetings. So by the time you watch this video, you may need to insert the word meetings every time I use the word event. Without further ado, to create a new meeting in the system, simply click on this plus button in the top right and select meetings. This little window will pop up and you can customize this to whatever you need it to be. So we could do initial meeting. It could be an all day meeting or a specific time. You could be the host or you could assign it to another team member. And here is where it gets really important. We can add participants to this meeting and invite them to join and make sure that it gets in their calendar. So to do that, I would simply click Add. And now I can select any of my contacts, any of my users, and even other modules that have emails as a part of them. So I could potentially add accounts and vendors and partners, depending on how I've configured my CRM. And at the end of the day, if you can't find the person, you could always add in an email address. Just like that. And if you had many, you could add many. And so really what this allows you to do is to make sure that your event or your meeting is in the calendar of everyone who will possibly be on the guest list. And I can, select up the, I can select any of these other details. Uh, it is worth showing that you can set up a, a repeating meeting. So maybe I have it daily or weekly, monthly, or even on a custom schedule, like perhaps once per quarter. And I can also add participant reminders. So perhaps 10 minutes before the event, uh, I will ping my participants by email. So when you're happy with all of the details and of course you've added the right participants, you can click save. Uh, apparently I have another meeting at that time, which is great. That warning has made sure that I book this to a different time. Of course, if you don't film a whole bunch of videos in a row, <laughs> this problem won't happen to you. Go ahead and click save. And now you have the option of inviting your guests or not. And so, of course, this corresponds with an email notification. So I am going to send this to all my participants because I want them to see the email and be invited. All right. And now if we look at my calendar, we will see that I have the initial meeting tomorrow at 3 p.m. And apparently in another video, I created the initial call. And just like that, we've created a meeting and invited participants. It's a really simple process and it can be done anywhere in Zoho CRM. And it makes use of emails that you already store in your contacts lists and other modules. So I hope this video was really informative. Please give it a try. Let me know how it goes. Thank you and have a great day.